back. We've shared stories each day this week about Central Georgia's declining private school enrollment and what leaders are doing to change the trend at Tattano Square Academy and Macon. They launched an aggressive and successful fundraising effort, netting more than $300,000. Pepper Baker gives us a closer look inside Tattano and also tells us about the school's plans to celebrate 50 years of education. What better way to celebrate Tattano Square Academy's 50th anniversary than by giving it a facelift? Head of school John Hankinson takes us through the five major changes students can expect to see next school year. Our goal was $300,000 and we expect to meet that and exceed it uh, here in the next uh, few weeks. Hankinson says that was always the plan for their golden anniversary campaign this year, but they didn't expect to receive an offer from a private donor to match an additional 50 grand. Probably about a month ago, uh, as we had already launched the campaign, uh, we've seen a lot of uh, interest in that, obviously. Uh, it's a great opportunity for our parents and grandparents and alumni to uh, match that very generous gift. That money is going towards cosmetic upgrades to their campus. We're planning on buying new lunchroom furniture this summer, uh, some renovations in Trojan Hall to our fine arts complex, also some athletic renovations on the football field, the, the track, and possibly the press box. And we're looking at adding some uh, interactive technology in, in several of our classrooms. They also plan to do a fresh paint job and add new floors in their old gym, which hasn't been updated since 1988. Hankinson hopes the improvements will help Tattnall grow. Um, we're one of the few schools in the Macon area that has seen enrollment increases in the last couple of years, so we hope this does nothing but continue those uh, increased enrollments. After working at the school for 23 years, he says it's the perfect time for an upgrade. It's just a time for us to look back on the past and celebrate it, um, embrace the present where we are now, and more importantly, plan for the future. In Macon, Pepper Baker, 13 WMAZ News. Now, Tattano currently has 525 students enrolled from preschool up to 12th grade. Director of Development Brandy Fountain says they're on track to reach that additional $50,000 challenge by the end of this month. 